Welcome to our informative video on the seven super vitamins to combat calcium plaque in your heart and arteries. Keeping your heart healthy is essential for a good life. A big part of that is making sure your arteries, the blood vessels in your body, stay clean and free from something called calcium plaque. Now, calcium plaque is like trouble for your arteries. It makes them narrow, and that's not good. It can lead to heart problems and even things like heart attacks or strokes. Eating right and staying healthy with exercise is super important for your heart. But guess what? Certain vitamins can also be like superheroes for your heart. These vitamins do an amazing job fighting against calcium plaque. In this video, we're going to introduce you to these fantastic vitamins that can help keep your arteries clean and your heart happy. We'll also break down how these vitamins work their magic and how you can make them part of your daily routine. Before we dive in, please do us a favor. Hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. That way you won't miss any of the important videos we have coming up. Are you excited to learn about these awesome vitamins that give calcium plaque a run for its money? Let's get started. Kicking off our countdown is number seven, vitamin D. Vitamin D, often called the sunshine vitamin, is a crucial player in how our bodies handle calcium, and it's not just about building strong bones and teeth. When we focus on heart health, vitamin D steps into a bigger role. It's not just managing calcium, it's also keeping our heart in check. Studies have pointed out that if you're running low on vitamin D, your heart might not be too happy. In fact, you could be at a higher risk of getting some unwanted visitors, like calcium plaque in your arteries. One study in the Journal of the American College of Cardiology found that those with lower vitamin D levels had more calcium plaque in their coronary arteries. But vitamin D isn't just about calcium, it's also a master at calming down inflammation. See, when your arteries are all inflamed, it can lead to a condition called atherosclerosis, where plaque sticks to your artery walls. But vitamin D steps in like a superhero, taming that inflammation and helping your blood vessels stay in good shape. Now, the best source of vitamin D is the sun, so go out and catch some rays. But if sunshine is rare where you live, you can find vitamin D in certain foods like fatty fish, like salmon and mackerel, fortified dairy products and egg yolks. Rolling in at number six, we have vitamin B6. Vitamin B6, also known as pyridoxine, is like the handyman of vitamins in your body. It's involved in lots of important jobs, especially when it comes to your heart. It keeps an eye on your homocysteine. That's an amino acid that gets produced when your body breaks down proteins. Now, if you've got too much homocysteine floating around in your blood, it can spell trouble for your heart. High levels of this stuff increase the risk of heart issues, including that pesky buildup of calcium plaques in your arteries. When that happens, inflammation happens, your cells get stressed out, and it roughs up the walls of your arteries, and you definitely don't want that. But here's where vitamin B6 steps in as the hero. It helps with the metabolism of homocysteine, basically turning it into friendlier compounds. By making sure homocysteine gets properly broken down, vitamin B6 helps lower the risk of heart problems, like those calcium plaques we talked about earlier. A study in the Journal of the American Heart Association analyzed data from 10 different studies and found that getting more vitamin B6 in your diet can reduce the risk of coronary artery disease. Another study in the European Journal of Clinical Nutrition discovered that having low levels of vitamin B6 is linked to a higher risk of heart disease. So to get more of this heart-healthy vitamin B6, eat foods such as poultry, fish, beef liver, chickpeas, bananas, and cereals that come with an extra B6 boost. Coming in at number five, we have vitamin K2. Vitamin K2 might not be as famous as some other vitamins, but it's a real champion when it comes to keeping your heart in top shape. It partners up with vitamin D and calcium to make sure calcium is absorbed by your bones where it's supposed to be. This teamwork helps keep your bones strong and sturdy. Now, here's where it gets interesting for your heart. Vitamin K2 has a knack for preventing calcium from sneaking into your arteries and causing trouble. Instead, it guides calcium to your bones where it's useful. 
One study in the Journal of Nutrition found that people who get more vitamin K2 in their diet have a lower risk of developing calcium plaques in their arteries. That's great news for heart health. Another study published in Atherosclerosis, Thrombosis, and Vascular Biology also showed that increasing your vitamin K2 intake can reduce the risk of heart problems. So how does vitamin K2 work its magic? It wakes up some proteins called matrix GLA proteins, MGP, that prevents calcium from settling down in the walls of your arteries, where it can cause trouble. Vitamin K2 helps keep your arteries in good shape and lowers the risk of those pesky calcium plaques forming. Now where can you find this heart-friendly vitamin? Some good sources include fermented foods like natto, certain cheeses, and organ meats. Rolling in at number four, we have magnesium. Magnesium might not be a famous vitamin, but it's like a superstar when it comes to keeping our bodies running smoothly. Magnesium helps maintain harmony in our bodies. It ensures that calcium doesn't create trouble in our arteries, but instead goes where it's needed. Research published in the journal Atherosclerosis found that people who get more magnesium in their diet have a lower risk of ischemic heart disease. Another study in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition supported this, showing that higher magnesium intake is linked to a reduced risk of heart issues. Magnesium helps relax the smooth muscles in our blood vessels, promoting better blood flow. Plus, it helps in calming down inflammation and reducing oxidative stress, both of which are big troublemakers when it comes to artery plaque and heart diseases. To keep your magnesium levels in check, look to foods like leafy greens, nuts, seeds, legumes, whole grains, and certain types of fish when you're planning your meals. Next on our countdown is number three, vitamin C. Vitamin C, that famous supporter of the immune system, is quite the multitasker. It's not only excellent at keeping those pesky colds away, but also works wonders for our heart's health. While it often gets the spotlight for its cold-fighting powers, it's also a superhero when it comes to preventing calcium plaque buildup in our arteries. This vitamin is like a superhero antioxidant, fighting off those troublemaking free radicals that can damage our artery walls and stir up inflammation. This duo of oxidative stress and inflammation is what sets the stage for atherosclerosis and the development of calcium plaque in our arteries. By stepping into the ring and reducing this troublesome twosome, vitamin C acts as a shield for our artery walls and promotes overall heart health. Now, let's talk about another superpower of vitamin C, its ability to help produce collagen. Collagen is a strong and stretchy protein that provides strength and elasticity to our artery walls, making them less inviting for calcium plaque. With an ample supply of vitamin C, the collagen production line runs smoothly, ensuring that our artery walls remain robust and flexible. Researchers have been delving deep into vitamin C's role in heart health. A study in the journal Nutrients celebrated higher vitamin C intake for its link to a lower risk of cardiovascular disease and mortality. Another study in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition applauded higher vitamin C levels for their connection to a reduced risk of subclinical atherosclerosis. Boosting your vitamin C intake is a breeze when you incorporate fruits and vegetables into your meals. Fruits like oranges, lemons, strawberries, kiwis, bell peppers, broccoli, and leafy greens are rich sources of vitamin C. We are almost at the end of our countdown. Before we continue, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more healthy natural remedies. Moving on to our countdown is number two, coenzyme Q10, CoQ10. Coenzyme Q10, CoQ10, might sound like a mouthful, but it's a tiny powerhouse that operates inside each of your body's cells, including those in your heart. It plays a crucial role in generating the energy your heart needs to keep pumping. But CoQ10 isn't a one-trick pony. It's also a superhero when it comes to fending off harmful molecules called free radicals and reducing oxidative stress. If left unchecked, oxidative stress can lead to heart issues, including the dreaded buildup of plaque in your arteries. Think of CoQ10 as your heart's sidekick, helping it function at its best. Studies have suggested that taking CoQ10 supplements might improve how your arteries function and even help prevent plaque formation. For example, 
One comprehensive review in the journal Atherosclerosis pointed to CoQ10 as a potential booster of endothelial function, which is essential for maintaining healthy blood vessels. Meanwhile, research published in the International Journal of Cardiology supported CoQ10's ability to reduce arterial stiffness, which can be a problem for people with coronary artery disease. CoQ10 also has an anti-inflammatory superpower, which means it can help calm down inflammation in your artery walls. This inflammation is a known accomplice in cardiovascular issues, so CoQ10's ability to reduce it might be just what you need to prevent plaque buildup. While your body naturally produces CoQ10, this production can slow down as you age or due to certain health conditions. That's when CoQ10 supplements can step in, especially if you have cardiovascular risk factors or a CoQ10 production slowdown. While you can find some CoQ10 in foods like organ meats, fish, and whole grains, relying solely on your diet might not provide enough. That's where CoQ10 capsules or soft gels come into play as a convenient way to bridge the gap. However, as with any supplement, it's essential to consult with a healthcare professional before starting CoQ10 supplementation. They can guide you on the right dosage, taking into account your unique health situation and ensuring it won't interfere with any medications or conditions you have. Last but not least is number one, vitamin E. Vitamin E may have a humble name, but its role in our cardiovascular health is quite remarkable. This fat-soluble vitamin is a potent defender against oxidative stress, a key player in our body's fight to maintain health. In the world of heart health, Vitamin E steps into the spotlight by preventing the oxidation of LDL cholesterol, which is known to play a significant role in the development of atherosclerosis and the formation of calcium plaque in our arteries. When LDL cholesterol becomes oxidized, it becomes like a Trojan horse, sneaking into our artery walls and setting the stage for plaque buildup. Here's where vitamin E comes to the rescue. Its antioxidant abilities stop the oxidation of LDL cholesterol, acting as a protective shield that keeps our arteries healthy and reduces the risk of plaque formation. Research in the Journal of the American College of Cardiology, which looked at 14 clinical trials, suggests that vitamin E supplementation can modestly reduce the risk of coronary heart disease. Additionally, a study in the Journal of Nutrition found that higher dietary vitamin E intake is linked to a lower risk of peripheral artery disease. However, the story of vitamin E isn't without its complexities. While some studies show promising results, others bring uncertainty and inconsistency. There's ongoing debate about the best dosages and forms of vitamin E supplementation, highlighting the need for further research in the world of cardiovascular health. So if you're interested in increasing your vitamin E intake, there's a tasty path to explore. Nuts, seeds, certain vegetable oils like sunflower, safflower, and wheat germ oil, as well as spinach and leafy greens, are all delicious sources of this vitamin. Each bite not only brings delightful flavors, but also the potential to protect your arteries from plaque buildup. So, there you have it the key vitamins that show promise in preventing the buildup of calcium plaque in your arteries, which can contribute to heart health issues. Adding these vitamins to your daily routine through a balanced diet can strengthen your cardiovascular health and reduce the risk associated with calcium plaque accumulation. However, it's essential to have a conversation with your healthcare provider before making any changes to your diet or starting a new supplement regimen, especially if you have existing medical conditions or are taking prescribed medications. Taking proactive steps to nurture a healthy heart is crucial for long-term well-being. Alongside a diet rich in these vitamins, it's important to incorporate regular physical exercise, manage stress, and maintain a wholesome lifestyle. If you found this video informative, please show your support by clicking the thumbs up button and sharing it with your friends and family who could benefit from this information. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring the notification bell to stay updated with our upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Stay curious, be proactive about your health, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.